Good morning guys, hope you guys are having a shit one. So right now we in this small pit. Not sure what is up there, but it's like a small village and there is like a big Buddha thing. So I think it's like a tourist spot for you to visit. And I'm pretty sure there's a lot of scenery for you to take pictures as well. So right now we are using the Crook app once again to book because it's cheaper again rather than you going to the counter then to book because the counter there is about 239 Hong Kong dollar whereas if you use the Cook app 101 Ringgit Malaysia there is some difference so right now we're gonna make a booking online on Cook so if you haven't make sure to download the Cook app if you are traveling around because it's not just Hong Kong there's also other places where you can use the Cook app so download the Cook app and then you can make full use of the promotion price the cheaper price offered by Cook after this, we're gonna go up there. Catch you guys later. So right now we are in the cable car going up to Ngoping 360. Uh, it might take a while to go up, so for now we're just gonna enjoy all the views. So, yep. So this is where it is the cable car going there and going up, going up there, and then I think going up again. I'm not sure where already, but yeah, you get the idea. Just like that, we have arrived to Ngoping. Uh, as you can see, I'm not sure you can see, right behind me is where the Buddha is. So it's like a small village here uh, on top of the hill. Uh, I guess it's nice to come here to visit. Uh, you can use the cable car for quite a reasonable price. It took quite a journey to come up here. But nonetheless, I think it's um, good to visit here if you haven't already visited. And of course, there's still like Christmas decoration around here because it's close to Christmas season. Right now it's very very cloudy, it's probably not a good one to take nice pictures but we'll just see what we can do with it. The overall map. So right here we got all the good things you can, you know, I'm not sure what is it actually means with the gong but prosperousness, yeah, you can see this side and as well as this side. It's good to take pictures with, so, yep. I'm there. So right now we have arrived. 
there is the staircase going up to that Buddha. It's a very beautiful and nice village right here. And right now we are walking up there. There's a lot of steps to walk. So let's go. Of course along the way people will take pictures so yep. See, there is the Buddha, and obviously we are not Buddhist, so people just come here to take pictures because of the nice view, and it's on top of the mountain, and we have arrived. So this is the current view, we are on top of the mountain above all the other tall tall mountains here and this is the Buddha statue You can still come here to visit um, you know, still one of the tourist spots here in Hong Kong uh, especially using the cable car up to this small beautiful town it's nice to visit here and of course, it's very, very cloudy right now, so I try my best to take some nice pictures from here. A cow, friendly cow in front of us. Just chilling. And that's a cow crossing. <laughs> so we just bought this jerky. This one is pork and this one is beef. I'm hungry, so let's enjoy this. Ooh. And we are done at here. Bro, good experience if you haven't been here, so make sure to come here if you haven't. Uh, use the cable car, you have all the nice view at here. It's very easy to travel around here in uh, Hong Kong because you just have to follow the map and even in the map the MTR map it will show this place as well so from wherever you are you just follow the map you will find your way so right now I'm gonna use the cable car going back down okay so at Hong Kong is very famous for this machine souvenir machine so what you're gonna do is put in the $10 coin and then you turn it And just like that, we are back down on the land here. So this is our view right now. It's already like in the evening already. This building is amazing. I can't imagine how many units are there in this block itself. Insane. Welcome to Hong Kong.
Hey, what is up guys? So right now, again, I'm back at the hotel. I hope you guys are not bored with this view of me ending my vlog here. So basically, today's video, I'm just focusing on my experience in Ngoping 360s. I hope I did a good job by showing you guys what is like Ngoping 360. Of course, if you are coming to Hong Kong, I think it's one of the tourist spots that you should go visit. And I believe if we go there um, when there is like a proper sun, I think it's going to be a nice view of everything because we are surrounded by all the high high mountain at there but when we arrived there it was quite cloudy but it's also good because it's nice to walk because you really need to walk up a lot of stairs i'm not sure how many stairs but nonetheless um towards the end there's also a little bit of sunset going on so i managed at the same time i managed to take pictures of there and of course if you haven't make sure to follow me on my instagram because i'm going to post up all the pictures that i take in Hong Kong and post it up on my Instagram. Once again, if you think this video is useful and you watch until the end of the video, make sure to hit that like button to show your support. And of course, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And I'll see you guys at the next video.